work, wasn't it? So you need to open up your YouTube channel, log in as the admin, go to the go live button, and this is where you create your stream keys. Cornell is now creating a new stream key with its name, Stevie CIS. It's important that you select um, a variable bitrate. And what else you're looking for here is um, when the un unlisted live play um, finishes, that um, the video goes from a live to an unlisted video, so you can hide the content later. Leave all those settings as they are. And if you just click on the eyeball going further up to that section, that's the key that you will need to send to the video team who are streaming. They put that code into their streaming box. And you also need to send those two um, co uh, URLs below as well. So copy and send all that information to us. It's a publicly listed video. Um, so we don't have to touch anything in analytics at the moment. Just click through Cornell. Yeah, so just leave that and then click over to stream health. Just leave all that as is, go back to stream settings. Now, if you need to make a change, you can go up to the edit button on the top right hand side. Uh, you can uh, scroll down Cornell. So if any of these things need to change, you can change that. You can put a thumbnail in that section there. Ideally that all our streams should, um, if you click on that Cornell, the, there should be a playlist for DVCIS on the main YouTube channel for the uni. If you could select that, that would be great. And uh, scrolling down, no, it's not made for kids. Uh, it's not a paid promotion. And of course, any tags that are appropriate, uh, language, English, etc., etc. And most of that is pretty um, standard. You could put a recording date in there if you like. So up here, Cornell, yep, yeah, click on recording date. You can select that date as well. We don't necessarily, you don't want that, Cornell, no. no. So, so we've removed, so ignore what I just said. Um, distribution everywhere allow embedding needs to be clicked on and whether you want um, likes and dislikes to be clicked on that's that button on the corner okay so you can uh, save all that if you need to make any changes that's and once that's done you basically send the information that's in this area here to us and then we can send a stream this button here it's really important that on the day that we stream that 15 minutes before the actual stream event so if it's a 12 o'clock start at 11 45 this needs to be clicked on so that um, without someone clicking that on this stream will not go to YouTube